Welcome to the project demonstration of density based traffic signal controlling system by using image processing along with Raspberry Pi and PIC 16F 877A microcontroller. So here uh, density uh, will be identified with the help of image processing using Raspberry Pi uh, 3 A plus model we are using. So for image capturing purpose Pi camera which was attached to the Raspberry Pi model. Once the image got captured then the system will process that. Based on the TensorFlow algorithm in uh, CNN we are going to classify the images. So that classification will be done uh, through the object detection that is a man or like a human person or a tree or cars or buses. So now we are going to identify the vehicles only. If the number of vehicles found in that particular image, if the number of the vehicles increases the uh, crosses the three number then automatically the Raspberry Pi will inform to the peak microcontroller about the number of vehicles present more then the traffic is high then the microcontroller will take a decision to on the green light timing is 12 seconds if it is normal 6 seconds 12 seconds high traffic density so here uh, we have interfaced these 12 LEDs to the PIC 16F 877 microcontroller at C4, C5, D4 to D7 and B0 to B5 and next A0 to A3 for the stepper motor means our microcontroller informed to the Raspberry Pi change the direction then the stepper motor will rotate 90 degrees exactly for the four sides scanning purpose once it reaches this ending side then it will back to the normal zero position that will be identified with the help of this limit switch so the limit switch is nothing but zero position so our microcontroller provide four seconds time for scanning purpose after the four seconds completes Raspberry Pi will inform to the microcontroller about the traffic density high or low through this A4 pin so this is the pin is connected from the Raspberry Pi. So here we can see the two wires black and brown. Black is the ground, brown is the output trigger pulse to the microcontroller at A4 pin. If it is high, it's indication of high traffic density. If it is low, low traffic density. So when we switch on the gate, it will take around 15 to 20 seconds for booting purpose. And after that, it will rotate the stepper motor for zero position. So once it reaches the zero, the controller hold the micro hold the signaling timing for four seconds. Means then the Raspberry will capture and scan and inform to the microcontroller about the traffic density and then after it will on the green light for 6 or 12. So when the green light is getting switched on then after uh, 6 seconds duration the system will run the uh, stepper motor for other side. So like this continuous process will be done. So let us see the demonstration. Let me show you without any vehicles initially. So initially on the power supply we are going to put the two adapters one is uh, power supply for the uh, Raspberry Pi this is a power supply for the Raspberry Pi and this white cable power supply for this microcontroller just on the power supply to the Raspberry Pi initially and uh, then on the power supply to this microcontroller so you can hold this reset switch for hold this reset switch or else you can just disconnect the power supply which till the light gets switched on on this camera right now the light gets switched on means now it is scanning then only on the power supply to this microcontroller means on the power supply for the raspberry pi initially then after once the light got switched on on this camera then on the power supply to the microcontroller so it will on the right now it is back to zero now see so you can count the timer also four seconds duration once the 4 seconds completes, so green light. You can check whether it is 6 seconds or 12 seconds. Once 6 seconds completes, it will pass through that. Again, after 6 seconds, it will already the stepper motor. And after 4 seconds, the green light come to this side. And after 4 seconds, again, after 6 seconds. Changing of green light, 6 seconds or 12 seconds. Stepper motor holding for 4 seconds here. So if the stepper motor rotates after 6 seconds, it's a normal uh, traffic, right? So after 4 seconds, uh, the green light will be changes, right? Now let me fill this side with high traffic. So this is a line, V plays the for uh, now you can count it now so when the green light comes now you can count the timer 
so if it is 6 seconds then it is normal or if it is 12 seconds then the high traffic density so you can see that now the timer is reaches the 12 seconds then only the step mode rotates so it's normal and high density will be identified in this manner with the help of image processing using raspberry pi with tensorflow cnn algorithm with microcontroller right